I'm at the train station on my way to Philly for my birthday weekend with my boyfriend and my black lab. I'm so excited because when I get to my boyfriend's house, I get to show my, I mean, get my new camera. So it's a situation. My, it's like 7.10 or 7.20 right now. And my train doesn't come until 8.30. <laughs> and attention, this is this morning call for that track. So, we'll be here for 897. And reach my So, hungry. But, I'm going to hit y'all when I go on a train. And, yeah. Wait, y'all should see my nails. I'll be so cute. So girly. Baby, you don't know what you do to me. Between me and you, I feel a chemistry. I won't let no one come and take your place. Cause the love you give, you can't be replaced. So go on now. So I just got home um, from Ikea and work and I just bought a new duvet. I bought a frother, which I've been meaning to buy for some time now. Let me see. Got a frother. That was like on my to-do list. And I need to change this from September to October. But I'm about to clean my house. It's Friday, but I'm about to clean my house because like I'm not gonna be satisfied. Like if I lay down right now, I'm just not gonna feel good. Like I need to clean my room. Like my room is a mess. A mess. A mess. A mess. I need to change my sheet. I just love the base. I need to put this blanket in the duvet. Like it's a mess in here. Okay. And the rest of my house is a mess too. I need to change my son's sheets. I need to put his blankets and the things so I can wash them. I'm not going to show you his room because this is his business. But, yeah. I'm going to think on top of that. Plus, I need to make dinner for myself. Like, I just have a lot going on. And I'm going to take this Friday. And I'm going to do that. Because, like, I'm not about to wait. I'm not about to wait. I need to buy some new stuff in my living room. Like, I have a lot to do. Like, my kitchen is a mess. I be rushing in the morning for work because my alarm be going off at 4.30, but the girl don't get out of bed until like 4.50, just because I know I will make it, but that's not healthy. I was, aren't they so pretty? They're blooming like so gorgeous. Like this one, this big, like it's out here. Your girl said I'm here and I'm here to stay. Real pretty, really cute. No, nothing to me at all. So that's what we're gonna get into and I'm gonna spin again. So right now I have on a aloe vera mask. Let me see. Yeah, I have aloe vera on my face. I'm gonna leave this on my face and then I'm about to get dressed like in gym attire and go for a walk with my son. <clears throat> something that I've been needing to incorporate into my like routine is like I need to get more mobile like because I sit down in the office for eight hours a day mostly and like I'm noticing my back and my hips are starting to hurt so I'm like okay well I'm about to start going to like outside to walk or to the gym there's a gym really across the street and I thought about joining it next month or maybe like at the end of this month so we're gonna let this sit. I love this color. My boyfriend gonna say, these look like Miami stripping nails. That's like the color that's what it reminds him of. Like, okay, so I'm just here to do a quick skin check. Um, I know if y'all watched my video probably like two months ago, my skin was 
terrible. Um, but this side of my skin is coming along. Um, it's looking pretty good. I think I just need to get a facial and I'm getting a chemical peel next month. And then this side of my skin can be a little problematic. This I just got this week. I had some apple pie, some sugar. But if you watched my video two months ago, you know my skin was terrible. And this looks so much better. So, I'm excited to like just rejuvenate my skin and get rid of like a layer of dead cells, dead skin cells. Like two months, maybe like since like, yes, yeah, probably the past month. So, September really. I have been so emotional so just like what is life like really anxious really I don't want to say depressed but just like in this dark place kind of like I just been noticing like I'm super critical of myself super analytical I'm always analyzing like sometimes I feel like I'm so much in my head that I can't enjoy the moment like I can't engulf in a good time because like I'm just so in my head like I'm worried about like just worry like everything is a worry everything has like been so tremendous just to like exist so my boyfriend has been giving me like really good pointers and y'all know it's what October today's October 9th um Mercury is in retrograde so shit really heavy on top of like already feeling super eh so yeah like my thing is like I just have to keep going I guess like like my thing to myself and to others if you ever feel like this like yeah, Joe just keep going like just fight through it fight for your life like fight for feeling through your feelings um and ask for help too like yo don't be afraid to ask for help don't be afraid to be like yo today's not a good day i'm not feeling it like i need some extra love maybe i need some silence like don't be afraid it's the man wanted down the street and it's funny <laughs> but um yeah like just be in tune like it's nothing wrong with um knowing like this how you feel and i feel it's nothing wrong with feeling like that like damn i'm really i really feel fucked up right now like i don't feel my best self like I just feel crazy. I've been spazzing out at my boyfriend, just like tripping, like tripping, okay? Not feeling like the best mom because I'm on high, like I'm anxious, like I'm trying to be really patient with my son who repeats everything all the time, child. He's like, I'm hungry, I'm hungry, hungry. I'm like, okay, well, we in the car, ain't no food in here, so you need to wait till we get home. But just so anxious, so just nervous on edge, like. I be crying at work. I be crying mostly because I just be feeling like, yo, I don't understand how these people can come to this job every day and just be like, oh, okay, like, this is my life, this is my routine. Like, yo, I'm not happy with that. Like, I'm not satisfied. I'm crazy these past, like, three weeks. I'm feeling fucking crazy. Like, going insane. Like, real life, like, in disarray. That's like he telling my best friend, like, yo, I'm in disarray. Like, shit ain't right. But whenever I start to feel crazy like that, I know that something good is coming. Like, when shit start to get real weird, I said it in my last video, I think, like, in my last two videos. When shit start to get real weird, you do for a blessing. But what's crazy is, like, shit start to feel real all the time. And, like, blessings be lining up, but it just be like, damn, like, can you space them out a little bit? Like, space them out. I need some space. Like, I need some space to... <sighs> but I guess when you... Moving up the levels, moving the chains, like, is you built for it or is you not? And so, I just got to get through this weird ass time, like. So, yeah, if you feeling that, you feeling crazy, don't fall. Ask for help. Love on yourself. And when I say love on yourself, like, yo, if you need to bust out with tears, fucking bust out with tears. Like, it's so funny when people say, like, mental health. Like, oh, make a face mask and take a bubble bath. Like, bitch, that's not helping. Like, I need some rest. I need to scream, I need to cry, I need to stay in bed and not do nothing all day, I need to call out of work, I need to prepare 10 meals, I need to, yeah, like that, not like, oh, go 
I've been journaling though. I journal like at work. I don't write it down. I just type it on the computer and then I send it to my email or I send it to my boyfriend in the email. I just got to get it out. Like, I just been feeling like, fuck. So, yeah. All that cute ass bubble wrap shit. Like, bitch, no. I need to cry. Like, all, like, all day. And that's just what I'm going to do. And I'm an advocate for crying. Like, if you need to cry, cry. Like, I feel like crying is kind of like sneezing. Like, you got to sneeze, you got to get it out. Whatever needs to be out, needs to get out. Cry. Scream. Laugh. Binge watch a bunch of shows for a day, two days, three days, four days, six days, 20 days. Like, if that's your life and that's how you can cope and be like, oh, at the end of this, I'm going to be refreshed. Like, okay, I can square one, but, like, I can move better. Then do that. Like. Yeah, I just think when people be advocating for mental health and they be like, oh, face mask and face scrub and all this cute ass shit, like, bitch, no. Ascension and progression in life is not that cute. It's a really ugly phase and you just gotta get through it. That's it, like, get through it. So, succumb to your emotions and be like that or just use it as a tool. Like, yo, it's something that I want to do. It's something that I want to get off, like, I'm going to use this as a tool. So, yeah. Hey YouTube, so today we are making um, Vietnamese spring rolls. This is just some of the stuff that I'm using. A cucumber, some carrots, lettuce, avocado. I don't know if I'm going to fry this rice yet or put it into the spring roll. I got some shrimp. These are like really big. You can't tell, but they are huge. I also got a new carrot. So my hands are washed. That is the first thing you should do when you're cooking in the kitchen. Make sure you wash your hands. So I had these carrots sitting in some cold water. I'm about to dice them. Kind of small, not too small. They're already skinny. I think these are called julienne carrots. It's where you do it into these small, super small strings. So I'm making the fried rice first. Or at least I'm prepping. My favorite thing to do is pie prep. To prep dinner. It makes everything else. I also had some green beans that I. I don't know. That I die or that I. These are still frozen. None of this is cooked. Like I said, we are just prepping. And I think this is enough because I don't want a whole rack of vegetables in my front rack. This, um, I have my water. I just wash my rice like 24 times. So I have my water. And what I'm about to do is, Julianne is like making it into strings so what I'm supposed to do is like square the cucumber if it makes sense to y'all and then square I just learned this off of TikTok people be hating on TikTok and I just want to say that TikTok has excuse me a lot of nifty information like financial how to save how to budget how to organize what to do with your children know what stuff to look out for healthy stuff recipes like y'all just sleeping so i'm supposed to do any squares as you can see and then just cut them thin enough 
I'll actually be actually be using this in the um, roll so I'm only going to cut it like that and then I'm going to cut them in half. No me, no her. Weekend that just passed, we really fucking it up. Another important thing when you're cooking, clean your area. Take Aesthetically pleasing, so I won't be using it. My wife can be calling me in aesthetic or I really am. I don't care. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna reuse this. I'm so excited. I'm gonna grow me a little. This is a little too wiggly, so I won't be using that. I'm just gonna cut the bottom off. Cut the bottom off. Cut the bottom off of all of that. And there we have it. So this is just my prep. Now I'm gonna put some of this Boss Mati long grain rice. I love long grain rice. It's so much so good. I had some tikka masala last night and we used a long grain rice and it was cute. It was a time. So I'm gonna do this.
Yes, it's me. My sister. The living, breathing Leo of the family. Oh my god. The it baddest was, bee there is. It was never that. Because <laughs> yo, it was never that deep. But I miss you so much. This girl's a mess. Look, face the camera. We can take a picture. Where's the video? A video. <laughs> yes. Where we are right now? We in Dick. Your girl has to make a return. No. Yes. So unfortunate, but I got my money back. What did you buy? So I bought a bathing suit, like thinking it was like a sports bathing suit, you know, uh -huh. so I could go swimming, like right. practice and stuff. But it was only like a tankini. I like put it on and I thought like the underwear part was gonna cover, but it was just not covering. It's not covering it. So oh, okay. I guess I have to order one on like Amazon or something. So what um edge control do you have in right now? Oh you can see it? Yeah, because I need some. Got to be this part. Oh, it's gotta be glue? Yeah, then I just like tied the scarf down for like four five minutes. Okay. And I twisted my hair up. Cause I'm not doing anything this weekend, so once I go back to class, it should be nice and curly whirly. <gasps> yes. Okay. Dean's like, okay. So anyway, we just came from Wegmans, and he's crying because he wants to go to my stepdad's house, but we're going tomorrow. We're supposed to go today, but like, I had stuff to do. So we're going tomorrow. I have to get some gas first. I'm trying to think where the gas stations are. I know where they are, but um, I went to Wegmans and I'm gonna show y'all my grocery haul, like what I got. I never do that, but I think that would be so cute. Damn, is there a Costco? I should get some Costco gas. I am actually because um. I don't know, it's got some gas cheap. Like the only gas I put in my car is Shell or Exxon. That's not even like a bougie thing. Like I just trust them the most. Like whenever I put their gas in my car, it lasts the longest. So that's the only gas that I put in my car. And I also get like 91 premium gas because that's what my gas that's what my car takes. Um So we're about to go to the gas station, then we're about to go home, and then I'm gonna show y'all what I got from Wegman. So I'm back from Wegmans. This is my little mini, like weekly, not really weekly, but because I already went like last week to grab a couple things. So I got me some jumbo brown eggs, pasteurized. Um, these are not what I usually get. What I usually get is free range eggs, and um, that means that the animals weren't treated with hormones or RS. BT, I think, um, or any added, like you know, they were just wild animals doing anything until it was time to cut them up. So, I got some juicy, I was about to say juicy juice, I got some organic juice. This is watermelon strawberry flavored. There's only, I think, 13 grams of sugar in each little square, which is really good because they be putting hella sugar in, in children's drinks. And I try to look out for that because my son's already like super you know, boy and hella energy. So, and he's super energetic. So I got these, I got a three box, like a three pack because they didn't have any more single ones and yeah. So I also got my son some strawberry fruit spread because he likes peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. And my mother was watching my son while I was, you know, on my birthday trip and she went and bought this man. Let me show y'all what she got this man. I don't even know if it's in here yet. She went and got him apple jelly, which is nothing wrong with that, but it has high fructose corn syrup, and we don't do that in my house. So I'm about to throw this whole entire thing away, and it's not like I'm wasting anything because nobody should be eating it. I also got my son some organic um, cinnamon applesauce. All it has is apples, sugar, water, cinnamon, and absorbic acid to maintain color. Anything else, it be having like high fructose corn syrup and glucose and that. And I just be like, I'm not with all that. So, since I got a frother, I'm talking really fast. Since I got a frother, I'm going to be making my matcha lattes. So, I got me some vanilla. Um, this is wow, I think I got the wrong one because this has milk. Ew, I, I thought I grabbed the one with coconut milk. Ugh, if I could find the receipts for this, it's going back. 
because that's no or I'll just buy another one um I got my son some of these organic potato crisps they have potato flakes um palm oil tapioca starch salt sugar white pepper if you know Pringles has a whole bunch of additives and preservatives and artificial flavoring so I figured like get my son something that he can have for his lunches for school but make it with less bullshit I got me some honey for my tea <sighs> I got me some chicken wings as you can see these chicken wings are small these are small chicken wings y'all I don't want to say y'all but people eating you know super big jumbo chicken wings treated with a bunch of bullshit like hormones and treated with antibiotics so right here in this corner let's see let me zoom in it says no antibiotics or added hormones free range and vegetarian fed that means they weren't fed bullshit or like scraps they were intentionally intentionally fed um with grains and seeds and nuts um okay. um what am i trying to say like you have one piece of meat that was caged locked in confined stressed you know and then you have free range he's living his best life it's two different feelings there's two different energies going on. i'm really intentional about when i buy chicken it always has to have no antibiotics no antibiotics free range and no added hormones all the extra shit because you know, and I'm not going to lie, this pack of chicken tenders was $11, and this pack was 10 And I have a whole thing that I'm going to put on my website about, like, investing in, like, okay, you might eat chicken, but get you some top quality chicken. Like, get you some expensive chicken, no added extras, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. I'm not going to, like, ramble on about that. I got some butter masala Indian summer sauce because I'm going to make um, some couscous and chicken butter masala. I got these soy free butter sticks, um, non dairy, plant based. I got this. This is something new that I'm trying. Like, I literally just picked it up. Whenever I go, I always try, whenever I go to the store, I always try to find, um, like sauces or just something different that I haven't tried before. Um, especially when it comes to sauce, like wing sauce. Like, I always get, like, I remember how this one time I had this, like, honey barbecue wing that was in a container, like this glass and. You know, I feel like this is probably like a small company. Like, they don't sell these everywhere. So, I'm going to try whoever Jake is. His buffalo sauce. I got these chicken nuggets for my son's lunch. They are jackfruit. So, it's not like actual chicken. But, like, when I say they're really good and they actually have, they're actually seasoned, they're really good. Which is why I keep buying them. Like, right now, he has a pack already in the freezer because I keep buying them and I'm going to keep buying it again and again and again. I got some ranch seasoning because I'm going to make some buffalo wings tonight but something about ranch like when I be dipping my wings in it it just makes me want to throw up and I think it's because of the, the dairy like no can't do. I can't do dairy but yeah. I also got some chicken tikka samosas they're really good if you know what they are I got some more naan to go with the butter chicken and the couscous that I'll be eating. And I got my son some Love Grown Comet Krispies with toasted rice and bean cereal. So, basically it's just made out of better ingredients than regular, like, Cocoa Krispies. I'm just super intentional about the stuff that I put in my body. Like, yeah, okay, this stuff might not be the healthiest, like, these chips or eating meat, period. I feel like... As long as I'm intentional about the quality of the food that I'm eating, like, I'm okay with that. I also got some energy vitamins and B12 because your girl be fatigued. And I am a person that hates eating green vegetables, but I don't mind drinking my green vegetables. It has millet, armorant, armorant, buckwheat, quinoa, chia. Y'all can read. I'm not about to read all of this. Greens, veggies, and herbs. Organic sprouts. And it has probiotics. You know, that's good. It supports your digest digestive system. And last but not least, I have my Mountain um, Valley Spring Waters. They are the green bottle. The green glass bottle. I've also been very intentional about... Um, Damn, I just want to show that really quick. I've been super intentional about the water that I drink. 
and um, I don't really drink out of plastic bottles anymore. This is more expensive, and I think I only get, what, 12? But I only drink them, and if my boyfriend's home, we both drink them. But glass bottles, spring water, that's like the only water I drink. And sparkling, but they're always in glasses. I, I'm done drinking out of plastic bottles. Because they be like, oh, alkaline, but like, y'all be lying, so. That is my grocery haul, y'all. Today is Sunday. Um, I just got done doing my hair. I just got done doing my hair. And I also just got done doing my son's hair. I wanted to show y'all, but he won't come here like I asked him to. Alright, you ready to show your hair? Okay, let's see. Oh, plug. Are you ready? Okay, let's turn it this way. Are you ready? Wow. Dean and Mommy, we have the same hair. I also braided it. I don't know if y'all can really see it. The braid is on. He looks so handsome. Let me see your face. So handsome. So. Um. So we got going on this Sunday. I'm about to make some chicken wings. Um, I also have this oil that I made. It has rosemary and mint. No, rosemary and grapeseed oil. Rosemary is good for thinning. Okay, honey, I'm about to make dinner in a second. It's good for hair thinning. So, I'm going to sit under the dryer when I'm done cooking dinner. Because he's going to school tomorrow. I'm off work, but he's going to school tomorrow. And I'm going to my sister's house so I can edit and drop this video. So, we are about to be on the road. I'm about to drop my son off at daycare. It's a holiday, but daycare is still open, so we leaving. Um, then I have to go to Wegmans to return this coffee creamer because I thought it was coconut milk and it's regular milk, and we don't do regular milk, so I have to drop that off. Um, it's a gloomy day. It's like kind of cold. It's like 65 degrees right now. No sun. It's giving very Seattle or something. I don't know. It's probably, I don't want to say it's going to be traffic, but like whenever I am going, I leave work. I leave for work really early. I leave for work probably like 5 40, 6 o'clock. So the parkway don't be like traffic but it's eight so i'm figuring it's gonna be traffic after i go to wegman's to return this coffee creamer i'm going to my sister's to edit and then i'm gonna drop my vlog this afternoon it's cold I'm, are you cold yeah all right i'm gonna turn on the heat um yes right now i have aloe vera on my face and it's so tight it's like Ooh, ooh. Um, so yeah, we'll make the most out of today. I was gonna leave really, really early, but I was like, yo, you have a day off. Like, just chill, get some sleep, embrace the morning. You know, take it slow, take it easy. So, I'm excited for this day off. Like, y'all know me, y'all know. I don't like working, but I'm excited to be working on my stuff. So I get to work on my brand, Rich in Health, my website, and then I'm gonna edit this content and drop this damn video. I have so much, like, um, I have so much content on my phone and then on this camera. So we're gonna see what it do, baby. When I get to <clears throat> um, Wegmans, when I get to Wegmans, I will um, holler at y'all. 
so small dilemma left my wallet in the house and I didn't have um Apple Pay on but luckily I be sending my boyfriend like my stuff like if he's at home and I have to pay for something online while I'm at work I'd be like send me my code with my wallet at home so I had my code in my history which is probably not a good idea but I got this can y'all see damn it okay, okay. Coconut creamer. It's coconut milk. There we go. Coconut milk. All natural. It's sweet cream. Uh, when I get to my sister's house, I'm going to make myself a matcha latte. Uh, right now, I'm about to go to Chick fil A because I'm really hungry. And I didn't take my vitamins, so I need some fuel. I also need to get an oil change this weekend. Hopefully, God will get me through the week. I only have four days of work, so I'll probably go on Friday, like Friday afternoon. But, yeah, so we about to head up Chick-fil-A right quick. And then I'm going to head to Baltimore to my dusty little sister's house. Thank you. 